Good evening and welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Beer Reviews. It is the third beer of the four from one weekend. Um, so four beers from one brewer. Um, this weekend we're doing Atom, or I'm doing Atom. Um, and this one, so as I said on the last one, we have jacked up the ABV a little bit. And this one is Neutron Star. There it is. And it is a coffee and vanilla imperial stout coming in at 12% ABV. It says so right there. I love this 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 label. It's brilliant. That is for me is just superb. <laughs> just a little blue spot on a black background. Brilliant. So um it says uh, best before see base. There is no best before or canned on date on the bottom of this can. So can't help you there. Um, it does say here um result of a supernova. Supernova explosion. Neutron stars, the densest thing, the densest stars um, known to exist. A rich and complex imperial stout, aged on vanilla um, and locally roasted Guatemalan coffee from the blending room. It says that there. Now, as you know, if you watch me regularly, you know I love an imperial stout. So let's pop it off. Let's see what we've got. I'll pour the rest in shortly. So beer in a glass, what are we looking at? Jet black beer. I uh, half a finger of tanned head. It's gonna dis it's gonna it's gonna disappear in a moment. But it does look lovely. A bit of a swell. Um yeah, half a finger of tanned head. No light getting through it. Nothing floating in it. It looks decent. Let's get a nose. Let's see what we can smell. Let's go for it. Really nice. Roasted malt, heavy roasted malt. Milk chocolate, coffee definitely there. There's this little, uh, it's a nice sort of vanilla y um, butterscotch type aroma going on. That's lovely. Let's go for the body and carb. Cheers. Light to medium body, oily, velvety, carbonation is soft, all but non-existent. Um, that's excellent. It's got a lovely mouthfeel. Right, let's go. <coughs> Excuse me for the big old taste. Cheers. <sighs> Opens up with milk chocolate. Creamy vanilla. Um, that as that fades, you get into the roast, <coughs> the roasted malt, um, and that continues. And then the coffee comes in at the end. The coffee ground, the coffee grinds, um, and it just yeah, that's what you get. It's coffee. <coughs> then it goes bitter. There's a little suggestion of alcohol right at the back end of this beer. I'm getting a little warm sensation here, which is really pleasant. It's a lovely, lovely beer. No whistles, no bells, no novelties. It does exactly what it says on the tip. Coffee, vanilla, imperial stout, and that's your lot. So if you like that, then this is a this is a winner. It's certainly a sipper. It is what I'm going to finish on camera. I'm going to go away and watch some TV and drink and drink this. It's just beautiful. It really is beautiful. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Now there's a, <coughs> there is another version of this, or a lesser version of this, called Neutrino. This is about eight point seven, I think it is. It's it's under under nine percent, and it's a very similar style, but it's a little bit lighter in ABV. So I'll be keeping my eye out for that. I am. Um, so 
it'll be right there it is right so i'm gonna wrap this review up so atoms neutron star coffee and vanilla imperial stout at 12 percent do i like it yes would i buy it again yes would i recommend it to friends absolutely my friends who like imperial stouts will like this this is a lovely lovely drink <coughs> like i say no whistles and bells it's just solid um if you've had this beer let me know what you think please put a little comment in the comments box below as i said i say on all the videos i will link the atom brewery also below give me a thumbs up if you like the video give me a thumbs down if you don't subscribe in that bottom corner there let me know what you think about these four four beers from one brewer um, I've got about another five weeks worth already stocked up, ready to go. Um, so, anyway, one more left, and I'll see you on that one. Stay safe, and hail the ale.